the access of the internet right now, you know, will you be very easily to access the internet, you know, on your mobile phone itself, right? So other than just using laptop to go on online when the moments that you are outdoors or you are with your smartphone itself, you'll be browsing like for example Facebook, Instagram, or perhaps you'll be browsing videos and YouTube on your mobile phone as well. Now what will happen is that when the moment that you are actually browsing YouTube on your mobile phone, you will get that watch history and also that search history being stored on your mobile phones, right? And some of us will be worrying by saying that, you know, like, what if, like, other people is actually, uh, you know, like, watching on my mobile phones, you know, accessing to the same accounts, they will be able to know um, exactly of what um, videos that I have watched before or I have searched before, the keywords and things like that. How are you able to clear all these, um, you know, data on your mobile phone itself? Hey guys, this is Zavin from DMC. In this video, I'll be sharing with you how you can actually delete and clear all your watch history, including your search history on your YouTube, on your mobile phones. And I'll be using uh, iPhones for your demonstration. So. Now, right now, video content has been picking up, right? So, a lot of us will be actually watching some videos on, on our mobile phones, you know, watching videos on our mobile phones, or perhaps using some tablets. Yeah, so um, other than just browsing it on laptops, right? Definitely, laptop will be having a much more bigger screen, but if like, you are currently, you know, outdoors, you, you actually don't have the laptop with you, the only entertainment that you, you might be able to access is actually using your mobile phone. So, other than browsing on Facebook, Instagram, things like that, it's the others the device that you might have is actually browsing videos on YouTube itself, right? So what will happen if this is what you can see, right? Um, I'm actually using an Apple phone, yeah, iPhones over right here. So um, the process will be pretty much very, very similar, yeah, across a few different uh, mobile devices itself, yeah, but I'll be using um, iPhone as a demonstration software right here. So what you can do is that when you click into YouTube itself, right, on the homepage itself, YouTube will actually show all the recommendations to you. Okay, so what will happen is that, you know, it's very, very straightforward for me to understand uh, you, uh, what kind of contents that you like by just, you know, opening up your YouTube channel account because you actually show all the related uh, search history like that and YouTube will actually recommend you, um, you know, all the other relevant videos that you might be interested at well. So what will happen is that when the moments that are coming to your YouTube accounts, you know, I'll be able to know <laughs> what kind of content that you recently just do and also like same time, what kind of content that you'll be interested in, yeah? So my case, uh, pretty much, you know, if you can see one glance, I'm actually watching some Chinese, you know, videos of right here, and it's actually entertainment videos, yeah? So variety show, entertainment shows, and things like that, right? So, yeah, so basically, if you can see from here, um, yeah, that's pretty much my videos, right? So one glance, you can see what kind of content that I watch, right? So I make sure that I don't have, like, some any funny, funny things right here. <laughs> so straightforward, okay? So what will happen is that uh, some of us will be thinking of like, hey, you know, um, is it possible for me to actually clear off my browsing history, my browsing data? I don't want, you know, people to see what uh, other things that I like, right? Uh, some of us will be actually, you know, if I go into your YouTube channels, you'll be looking at different uh, recommendation video. If you have like, uh, sports, if you like sports, if you have been watching sports or magic tricks, you know, or perhaps like you like like animals, you like like investment, you like like motivation talks, you know, the recommendation videos on your homepage itself, you'll be pretty much very different, right? But uh, some of us, you know, we, we just, um, we might be sharing accounts with other people or, you know, someone will be actually accessing your phone and so, you know, to, to watch YouTube itself. So perhaps, you know, we will actually like to protect our privacy and we will actually like to delete off your browsing history and also your search history itself. So this is what you can do, right? Straightforward is at the very, very bottom top right, I mean, bottom right of your iPhone or your mobile phone itself, right? You'll be able to see that library icon right there. So what you can do is that you can just click on that library icon, okay? And then what we can do is that you can see that history right there, the history bar right there. Click under the history, okay? Click under the history, and this is the part that you will be able to see that, you know, this is these are all the previous um, search history that's, uh, I mean, the watch history that you have, right? So the things that you have watched before, yeah? Before itself. So uh, pretty much you can see over right here, I'm actually watching all my... 
um, my, my training videos, so all my videos from my channel itself. If you have yet to subscribe our channel, remember to click on the subscribe button below, yeah, to follow us and uh, make sure that you turn on the notification. Okay, so this is what happens. This, these are all the search, uh, browse history, if you can see from here, right, it's all the way until like uh, April, you know, like very, very long times ago, and yeah, all the history is still there. So if you didn't clear, it's pretty much, you will actually just stay, everything will be that. Okay, so what you can do is that you can actually, either you can decide you want to clear uh, for that particular day video, or you actually would like to actually clear all the video itself, right? So what you can do is that if you can see on the there, you know, on the uh, on the three dots on that specific videos that says I want to remove these videos, right? I will just actually remove from the watch history and that video will actually disappear. And on the ninth itself, I only watch one video, and that's pretty much empty, you know, empty uh, history right there already. Okay, so this is what I can do, is right. Second one, if let's say I would like to actually delete all all my search history, I can actually click on the top top right corner, and that's that three dots on the very very top right, and that's this history control. I'm actually going to click on that, and what you can see is that you can actually remove two things, okay? You can either clear all your watch history, or you can actually clear your search history itself. Search will be like, you know, you are searching for a particular keywords and things like that, right? But not necessarily that you are actually watching the video, but you're actually searching for the keyword. Yep, so search history is actually included over right here as well. Um, second one that we are looking at over right here is pretty much your, uh, what do you call it? It's your watch history. That is based on the videos that you watch, right? And two, two, two other settings that will be very interesting over right here is the pause, the watch history and the search history. So what will happen is that uh, by this pausing, right, it won't actually clear off the previous history that you have, but it's only prevent YouTube to catch, um, uh, to record, you know, the upcoming and the, the future uh, history that you have. But it's only pause like for that particular period of time that you actually turn on that pause um, history itself. Yep. So if let's say after the pause session, you actually come, come back and turn it off, then YouTube will actually collect the data again one more round. Yeah, so this is actually based on like, uh, I mean, a particular period, if let's say that you does not want, um, you know, YouTube to actually record the, the history itself, you can actually come here and actually turn on, you know, the post history itself. So what you can see from here is that, you know, like, uh, um, it's actually, uh, you know, you actually prompt this message and it will be actually asking you whether or not you actually would like to really um, pause your search history. If yes, then you just click on pause, right? And that's it. Yep. So if you can see, you actually turn on. If you don't want, you can actually turn it off and that's it. Lah. Yeah, so straightforward, right? So these are the two, you know, clear watch history and also clear search history itself. Yep. So I'm going to share with you um, the search history first. Yeah. Now let's have a look at the search, clear search history. So what you do is that you click on the clear search history. And over right here, right, you can actually just directly, you will just ask you for a confirmation if you would like to clear all your search history. If yes, you just click under the clear search history and you will actually remove all your search data right there. And that's it. You actually show you search history has been cleared and it has been cleared. So the same thing, if you would like to actually delete your clear watch history, um, you would like to actually clear all your watch histories, right? You just come here and click under the clear uh, watch history and this is what you do, right? Confirmation, click on the clear watch history. And there will be a message popping up that says that uh, watch history has been cleared. Okay, so that's it. Very straightforward and you know, pretty much what you can do is that you can just go back to your history itself and double check whether it has been already, um, you know, 100% being removed. So basically, let's double check, refresh the apps again, you know, I'm going to restart the apps again and go back and double check whether or not my history are still there. Yeah, so I'm just going to click under my YouTube and I'm going to go under the library sections again. If you can see from here, some of the history has been already removed from this page, but I'm going to double check internally, right? Click under the history again one more time. If you can see over right here, completely the, the list has no videos at all. So all my previous uh, history has been completely removed from my YouTube app itself. So right now you'll be safe and you know you can just um, you know lend your mobile phones to your friends or whoever that's you know who will be using your mobile phones and you not to worry that uh, they will be actually uh, able to see or 
you know, able to figure out so what you know what are the previous videos that you have watched because right now they have no record at all. Um, there will be trackings and all your homepage uh, data will be pretty much being reset again. Yeah. So um, that's all in this video that I would like to share with you how you can actually delete your YouTube channels, I mean your YouTube videos, watch history and search history in your in your YouTube applications account itself. So I hope you like this video. Um, you can leave a comment below and let me know whether or not you have successfully deleted, you know, all your uh, browsing history and also your watch history on your YouTube account. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, remember to leave your comment below. How is like and share? If you are yet to subscribe to our YouTube channel, remember to click on the subscribe button and most importantly, hit on the bell icon so that you'll be able to receive notifications when we launch our new video. See you in the next video.